What we study here in the Human Adaptation Lab is the way people walk. One of the things we do when we're collecting data is we put these reflective markers on the subject. And so we put markers in certain spots so that we know where her body is in space. And you can see it on the screen over there if you want to look at it. We can see how you're moving. That's awesome. What that allows us to do with the cameras in the room is pick up in 3D space where the person is. This data is then used by the computer to figure out joint angles and joint moments. Over time, the amount of walking that we do really can increase the loads on our joints. So what my research aims to do is look at how can we change the way somebody walks now in order to decrease those loads so that they're not damaging their joint later on. So this is kind of the normal way you walk. Are you having any pain while you're walking? Um, my hip hurts a little bit, but not too bad. The first thing that I notice is your trunk's a little bit behind you. <laughs> so I'm gonna have you bring your trunk forward a little bit so that your shoulders are over your hips. Good, and does that change your pain? Leaning forward, I don't feel it as much. Okay, so it doesn't pull on your hip as much if you're leaning forward. Yeah. And that really makes sense from a biomechanical standpoint. When you can measure it using this computer system, you can actually say, oh, there's a five degree difference in the angle there, or oh, I can see how these two are very different. And if I give somebody cues, I can see how it changes. You're actually in much better alignment, so that actually reduces some of the stress on your hips. Okay. So we try to think about what activities are we doing, so one of the ideas is if we can reduce your stress throughout the day, it can reduce your pain. Okay. As you get older, you want to stay active. If you can't because of things that you were doing in your 20s, it's unfortunate. So my research really looks at trying to figure out what should we be changing in our younger years so that we can stay active for a much longer period of time. <laughs>